My name is Marcin Kubacki, I'm Chief Software Architect at Storeware. Today I'm going to show you how to protect all of your environment, especially its configuration. So we are not going to protect virtual machines, we are focusing on the overt itself. With vProtect 3.7 we have introduced application backup. This allows you to execute custom commands and extends vProtect's base capabilities to protect well, virtual machines and applications inside them well, it can be also as well physical box or anything else that you can actually think of. Basically, using your own custom script. To protect Overt Manager, we basically we need to backup its database. So, first step is to create command execution configuration. The description what needs to be invoked on the Oracle VM Manager and later how it's going to be grabbed. In our case, it's going to be a file that resides remotely over SSH on the Overt Manager. We are using engine backup command. We need to pass a few more arguments, such as mode, scope, path to the output file, very important part. And finally, that we would like to export data from this host, which is file, and its location. You can optionally remove files after export. Once we have command execution configuration, we need to create actual application. Our application in this case, it's going to be OVM Manager database. First step is to provide name of the application. You need to specify which node is going to execute this backup pass optionally some environmental variables, specify backup policy because you may want to have certain set of schedules, particular backup destination that you would like to use. And very important part because the export process takes export processes being executed, executed over SSH, we need to provide SSH credentials. In section policies, we are able to edit particular application backup policy and assign more apps of this kind. So if you have multiple instances of your Overt Manager, that's the way to go. Now we are doing full backup of the Overt configuration. We are going to store it in IBM Spectrum Protect and we have submitted export task. Export task basically executes your command. This is supposed to produce output file in the location that you have specified. And once the export task completes, vProtect grabs this file and downloads to the staging space on the node, which obviously from now on can be later stored in some backup provider. Task has completed. So now we have successfully initiated backup on the Ovid Manager and stored it in IBM Spectrum Protect. Now we are going to restore backup to the original application. Original application in this case is our Ovid Manager. We can obviously restore it to the file system that is that resides on the node, but in our case we want to make this step a little bit easier. So we are providing path on the Overt Manager right now. vProtect is going to restore file to the node and later push it to the specific location on the Overt Manager. We can now check if the file is present after restore. Import has just finished and we see that there is a tar archive which should, con which should contain all of the files necessary. That's it. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next episodes.